Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are gonna make a tier list of every single operator in Rainbow Six Siege. I'm not the expert in it, I just know a bit about the operators. I'm gonna give it my best out of my experience in this game. What I play, what I do not play. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Have a nice day, have a nice evening. See you all later. Oh, oh. I almost forgot. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and ring the bell. I catch you all in the next one. See ya, boys. So, guys, as said in the intro, we are gonna make this tier list. Maybe I mispronounce some names because I don't know all of them from my head. Out of my head. So, let's go. The first one is Sledge. I love Sledge. I got. Black eyes for you, but I rather to have bugs. Yeah, I'm gonna say he's a easier because you can always use him. Have the cooking nade strat was really good for that, so that's kind of sad. But you can use it always a place to my opinion. opinion. <laughs> So the second one, the second one is the Thatcher. He's pretty good. He got his EMP nades. They are all right, but I don't know now. A lot of operators got this uh, impact. Yeah, they have less range, but for me it's a good combination with any hard brute. I'm gonna put at A. For now, maybe it's gonna change next season. I'm gonna try to make more videos like this from different games. So, what do we have as the next operator? Should we do first the attackers? Uh, I guess. So, next one in the attackers is Ash. Got his. Uh, is. <laughs> she got her ACOG back and. Her gun is awesome, but I'm just a noob. I cannot control it. But I see her pick rate is a lot, but I don't think she's here because she doesn't have that much utility. So we are gonna take her in A because of her gun and pick rate and her buff against Mira. The next one. Have my favorite hard hard breed catcher. He's the OG hard breacher and makes a better hole in the wall. So I'm gonna go with my first S. My own opinion. Maybe you guys are gonna disagree with it. Which she is really versatile. So I'm gonna put her at A because. I don't know. She's she gonna stay in A for now. Monty, pretty annoying to deal with, but if you have a good Monty in your team, it's gonna be a good. A lot of information for you now with the shield buff, you can knock people down. I'm gonna put him in S tier. We got glass. Glass is kind of mid. Pretty nice gun. Everything alright, but not my cup of tea. Everybody is going to hate me. I'm a uh, low, low B, I would say. I don't know. I'm gonna go for now B. Maybe it's going down. Fuse, I don't know. It's good if you have a cover and you fuse from upstairs something. Destroy utilities, but it's very situational, so I'm gonna put it at C. I'm not gonna discuss a lot because I don't want to waste your time, so we're gonna do it a bit faster. Now we got Blitz. I hate, hate this motherfucker, but Monty is better. Yeah, he got a flash, but you can't deal with a Blitz easier than Monty. I'm gonna put him in B. If you are good with him, you 
you are good, if you are bad with him, don't pick him. You're gonna regret it. So, then it's gonna be IQ or IQ. That's how you should pronounce it. Uh, she's alright, but she's limited with her gadget. It's pretty nice. But her gadget, you're limited to your PC. And me personally, I'm pretty shit fit. I think she can get some buff because she's one of the old. But it's my opinion. I'm gonna put her at because you can pick her, you must not. Here. And sorry for my ink. That I know that. The next one on attack, it's Buck. No question. A tier. Best soft breather ever. And do a lot with him. He got enough of gadget bullets of the shotgun. He's really good. From down, from up, opening walls, soft walls, I should say. Pretty good. Blackbeard. Pretty annoying for me. I'm gonna put him D tier because the shield never helped me really. That's just I'm bad. Bad. And the next attacker, it's Capto. I don't have that much experience with him, but I watched a lot of videos. He's really situational. He, you must combine his gadget with the other operators. I'm gonna put him at B. I think it's pretty good. Uh, the next one is Hibana. I love the gun. And uh, now with the changes, had a long time pause. Can choose how many from his star, uh, his again, her stars to throw at the hatch or the wall, but can just make head hole with her or vault in. I'm gonna put, I'm not gonna put her S, I'm gonna put her A tier. So, yeah, if Jekyll. It's pretty nice, both guns are awesome, and the gadget is just broke. Eight here. King, there's no question, pretty annoying to deal with. She got these candelas, nine time, eight time, six time flashes, back to back. Got how many of them? Three or four. The only counter for her is the warden, but. She's gonna be S tier because nobody can flash you <laughs> like Ying. So we have Tokabe. I love her. One of the best annoying up. I love the semi sniper, the secondary. Pretty bad, bad with the secondary SMG though, but always provide information and you can hack everything. So. <laughs> I'm trying to be fast, but sorry. Sophie, uh, she's like Ash. She got more ability. I would say Ash because of her gun. Top of A and uh, after Thatcher, I'm gonna. Yeah. Where do we have Lion? I don't know. He's annoying too, but I'm gonna put there because. Must have five stack to use lion really good and effective. I'm gonna put him at over sledge at the beat, and then we got wait a sec. Woohoo! <laughs> got Finca after the buff that she gives you the boost or low, it's gonna stay and heal you. Can revive everywhere and now with her uh, uh, LMG and the LMG buffs, I'm gonna put her at the top. top of the list. <sighs> Nobody in ac attack can do that, really. So I'm gonna put her at the second A tier. And we got Maverick for me, low because you can hear always Torch. He was really good. Is really uh, but that's his place for me. Then we got Nomad, one of the best anti-roaming operators. 
both guns are awesome the pistol was good now it's okay i'm gonna pair an a tier her pick rate is a lot higher than grid luck but if i wanna do that because of the room format for me much better so grid luck over the glass in B. Uh, the next one Ok, I doesn't have silent steps anymore. Her gun is trash. I like eagle, but nah, if that ain't it for me. Going to and we got Amaru. It's pretty situation. I should got the potential to be a A tier, not the S, but. If you are some dumbass like me, you are just gonna rush the side in the first five seconds and die. So, top C, almost B. And for me, the most underrated operator is Kelly because you can hold and play with him, dance, or to the secondary for rushing side. And her gadget helps, does help to. I'm gonna put her at in the middle of over glass on the middle of so she's good they have a lot of drones if you use her gadget as a drone I'm gonna put her at the tear in the act in the attackers and I'm not gonna speak a lot about her so we're gonna go next because I don't play her that much. But oh, got Ace as the next one. Ace, one of the fucking easiest heartbreak. He is going to be the second. So zero. A lot of camera anti roaming. Good guns. Ability. A hard one. I'm gonna put him in because you must learn how to how to use the gadget is going to be for me so what do we have as an attacker x almost me i think uh yeah florence question is pretty good the drone is good appearance or get some skill i died for three times since i'm back in the game to I didn't know I cannot counter his drone really. Just, I, the only choice is to run away. Going to be for. Ah, good question. Top of C for me. And this got also pretty annoying to deal with. All of proof build and good guns, I must say. The attackers, I'm gonna put her in A. And then got what do we got? Fans underrated, but kind of trash. Just the gun is good. Gonna be overfused. You know what? Bottom of bottom of seat. No, I rather to play few for him. It's my opinion. As said, don't get offended. It's all right. Cream played it one or two times. Area. And information, live pinging, and shoot the shoot the piece from the stands. So I'm going to A tier, and for me it's A tier, but at the bottom because I don't have any a lot of experience. Next, Bravo. I don't have her, but I tested her in the training. Saw uh, a lot of videos about her. Pretty nice. You can hack everything. But because I don't have her and don't have the experience with her, I'm going to top of the. I don't know. Maybe a lot of people are gonna get mad, but I cannot do something else. Ram. Pretty good. I have her, I love the gun, they use pretty fun to use. But Buck 
not at the same level. Keep going to there. Yeah, when I put the sledge. Ooh, hard. Going to downgrade sledge for Florian. Oh, we're almost there. Now we got Damien's last operator before the lot. It's not out, I think. It's going to be out in next week. Uh, Damien's. It's pretty nice to have him and play with him, but you can counter him. You have the map knowledge and everything. You can see him, where is he coming from. You can combine him with Jackal or Okabe. It's pretty nice, but not better than Jackal, I opinion. Got potential, uh, potential, but not that much. So I'm gonna put it in the top three of. So that was from the attack. Now we are going to have defender. We are going to stop everything. Here. Gonna start our defender. That's the first time I'm sorry if I'm slow. Let's do this shit. So we are going to start with defenders. There's a lot of good ones. So for example, these two a smog and mute for me. Directly. S tier, there's no question anything. Mute you can Hunter, almost all of the attackers. Small, pretty good. Space denial, and they both have the one of the best loadouts in the game. Castle, if you're not trolling, good. You got a, enough utilities. Gordy as a secondary. Acog, ump. <coughs> Now it's burning time. Calls for me, I don't have to think. E tier. Because I can counter him with IQ and. That's it. I don't know. Pretty nice to have it. Have him on the team. You can always pick him because of that. I'm gonna put it in. Doc, you can heal yourself. You can revive from distance. MP5. One of my favorite guns, the ACOG. I got the Rick skin. I'm a Rick and Morty fan. No question. Top of A. Rook. Ah, he got impacts. That's right. But I don't know. Overpulse. I'm gonna always rock. Capcom, one of the best trap operators. I don't have to discuss it. He got a pretty nice. G and gadget and secondary, and he got a need after for such uncle, Lord and Savior. I don't know, they reworked him two or three times. He is still, I don't want to put him in D, but for me, he's indeed. Jagger, I love the gun, I love the can always be because of that. It, if you can do a blitz trick, top of A, not the top of A, there's kite too, but A tier. Cross mats are kind of good, top of B. Valkyrie, one of the best guns, or well, one of the best SMGs, one of the best utility gadget, and deagle, gonna be S going to provide you with a lot of him. Have I don't know. Must bait a lot with her. I enjoy roaming with her because of her silence step and everything. Jekyll can you cannot see your tra uh, feet track. You're using your gadget correctly, but I don't know. N 
not a team character, but I'm gonna put her over Tachanko because I would rather to play Cav, not Tachanko. Echo. Versatile. I don't like to sleep around. But I played against Echoes. Can win 1v5. I'm gonna put him up there because he got good gun, good gadget. Secondary guns, SMJ I think. Hero, top of top duck. Always been, yeah. She got nerf against a lot of things, but she nobody can do it. Legion, if he had steel, had his impact S, yes, but doesn't have them new. Top of A. Low S. Big Ella, I think you are going to troll her, but still over Tachenko. Still good. B tier. Maestro A tier. A lot of information. Everything you need on it. One of the nicest loadout guns can trick or playing like me in copper with her clones or prismas i'm gonna put her at the third place in a so dash pretty annoying to deal with i hate her a lot of times she's banned in my rank but i'm gonna put her it's two Hide. Pretty annoying because of the hatches and everything. This is still good guns, good pistol, good utility, and a pretty nice game. Mazi, good loadout, like Maestro. Here. Grab. No. Nice throw. Yeah, I can leave. So, what do we have? Warden. He's pretty solid, but for me, here. Like B5. There. Goyo. Pretty nice. Loadout. Canisters. Pretty nice. Area denial. It's gonna be a top A. Why? Yeah, it's kind of versatile. I... Yeah, <sighs> he's going to top S, uh, A, low S for me. Oryx, pretty nice. Pretty fun to play. Going to be over. Yeah. I don't know. Melusi, kinda good. Got the MP5, but you need to know how to use her UP and gadget. So I'm gonna put her in the middle of B. Aroni, pretty annoying to deal with. A tier, I love her. PMR, uh, Thunderbird. Uh, I don't know. Top C. Gone, pretty nice gun, pretty good cra traps, but I rather to have Capcom than Torn because you can't dodge Torn pretty. As I mean, I'm not arguing. I heard they are going to nerf her in the next season. That you cannot make a pixel pick with her gadget, but still a top dog since she is out. Silas, uh, Solis, Silas. <laughs> he is uh, kind of good, but after the next update, she get pretty damn nerf. But she is still better than Falls, I would say. She's going to be here. Fenrir, pretty good. The nerf isn't gonna break his neck. Low S for me, personally. Uh, you must know how to play with 
our Portuguese friend Copy is pretty good. Has a good DMR, good loadout. Nitrocell can deny hard breaches. That's pretty nice to have. Who do we have still here from the Defender? Do we have all of them? We got all of them? How? Okay, now we are gonna look over this. Yeah, come on. He's going on top of there. He's gonna come here. Pfft. You know what? I'm changing my mind. Yeah, mid P. Okay, that's how it's look like. Not really all of them. I'm proud of ourselves. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Have a nice evening. See you all in the next one. Tell me in the comments which game with legends and operators should I do next.